Oh, hello everyone. This is Nurse Davis or Nurse Tiffany, whatever you like to call me. But um, we are excited about another school year. We um, understand with everything that's going on with COVID, you can't be in the building right now. So I just wanna talk about some of the reminders, some of the things that we've talked about before. So I hope you all are doing your hygiene checks. Do y'all remember what those are? Making sure that we washing up every day, we are brushing our teeth for how long? Two minutes, that's right, two minutes. Making sure we're doing our hair. Now, what about washing our hands? We wash our hands for 15 to 20 seconds. Long enough to sing, happy birthday, two times, or your ABCs, two times. Now, while you're doing virtual, it is very, very important to make sure that you are eating your breakfast, make sure that you're eating fresh fruits and vegetables, getting a lot of water in. All of those things are gonna help you with it you can learn. Because remember, you can't learn if you're not feeling good. Now, let's talk about one of my favorite stab, D-A-B. Destroy all bacteria. That is the way that we prevent from having germs and spreading our germs to other people. Remember, all of us have germs, so we have to make sure we cover those germs up. So we we dab. So if we are coughing, we need to go in our elbow. If we sneeze, ah, we gotta do that in our elbow. Now, what is the dirtiest part of your body? Do y'all remember that? Your hands, your hands are the dirtiest part of your, of your body because you touch everything. You're touching this, you're touching that. So if I cough in my hands <coughs> and I touch something, I'm spreading my germs. So if I sneeze in my hand <coughs> and I touch something, I'm spreading my germs. That's why we have to keep those things covered up. Now. Another very, very, very important thing. Remember, I still have these nasty germs on my hand. We have to keep our hands out of the T-zone. The T-zone, what is the T-zone? Keep your hands from out of your eyes, your nose, and your mouth. That's how those germs get inside of your body and we don't want those germs inside of our body. So we have to make sure we wash our hands again for how long? 15 to 20 seconds. Get in the front, get in the back. Make sure we get it all washed up really, 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 really good. Okay, now, we have the Kenza app. The Kenza thermometer. For those of you who participated last year or those of you who were not able to participate last year, we have the Kenza app. Our school has qualified again. Yay! Now, this thermometer is free. Free, 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 free. All you have to do is register. There will be some information coming as soon as I get that, and then we'll decide how we're gonna get that to you. But this thermometer is absolutely amazing. It is very quick, and you do have to download an app on your phone, but you can put your whole family on there. Your mom, mamas, daddies, your brothers and sisters, everyone can go in here. And then they give you all kind of ideas, you know, all kind of tips too, okay? So it is very important, parents, when our students are allowed back into the building, it is very, very important to make sure that you check your child before you bring them to school. Check your child before you bring them to school. Make sure they do not have a temperature, that they do not have all those nasty signs, those symptoms of COVID, you know, like the different. You can't taste good. You lost a sense of taste, a, lot, a sense of smell. You have this headache. You're running this fever. We don't want to get our friends sick, so you have to stay home and follow those guidelines. Now, let's talk about another thing. How do we function around all this COVID stuff, even while we're still at home? We have to wear a mask. Everyone has to wear a mask. Now, see, I have all these germs on my mask, so you have to put your mask on. Now, it is very important that you wear your mask correctly. Your mask should cover your nose. Your mask should cover your mouth. It should fit good. Now you see how I have germs all around here? This is nasty. So you can't touch this. You don't wanna touch this stuff. Remember, this is germs because everyone has all these germs. So all these germs out here, they're right here on this mask. So you don't wanna touch this. And you definitely don't wanna just take it and just lay it on the table right now this is what you should not do with your mask don't wear it here oops don't wear your mask down here that is not protecting anyone because you have your nose exposed that's how germs can get in there and get inside your body you don't want to wear it under your chin that's for football players 
then you have all of this exposed, especially if you don't wear glasses, you have all of that exposed. So you have to make sure that you wear your mask correctly. So let me put it back up. Should I touch the outside of that mask? No, because it has germs on it, okay? Now, when I take my mask off, I touch the elastic part. Do not touch the outside. I pull it from over my face, see here? And then I'm gonna fold it up and put it away in like a Ziploc bag or something, okay? We do not use each other's mask. I don't care if it's your best friend, if it's your cousin. We do not share masks. You use your own mask, okay? And you wanna make sure that if it's a washable mask, make sure mommy and daddy wash that mask. If it's a disposable mask like this, you get to wear that one time, one, well, one day. You can't put this back on, cause see, all of those germs. Now, social distancing, what is that? We all like to talk. Social distancing, that's one of the big things. We have to stay six feet away from each other. You can't be close to your friend, even though they're our friends, but we gotta protect them. We have to keep our masks on and stay away from everyone. I know that's different, but for right now, that's what we're gonna have to do. So, I am so excited to see you guys whenever we get to come back to school. We might have to do some of those air fist bumps. Make sure that it blows up. But remember, stay healthy, continue to do those hygiene checks, and do all the things that you can do to help keep your body healthy. And remember, have lots of fun. Nurse Davis really love you and I really, 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 really miss you. All right, take care.